Hello everyone, it's Viper26, or right here, and welcome to Far From Land, a Five Nights at Freddy's Roblox fan game. Um, I wish there was a way to add the I wish there was a way to full screen this. Let's just go normal. Um, Okay, starting a new game will reset all of your progress. Yes. Easy, easy mode to slightly reduce aggressive and on robots. And voyages are short. Voyages are shorter. It will also add small mechanics to assist your playthrough. Recommended for players who are not familiar with the core gameplay. No mode is regular and ideal way of playing the game. Recommended for players who are familiar with the series and core gameplay. For veteran. F N A M players, robots are more aggressive and voyages last longer. Not recommended for new players. I'm just gonna go normal. I don't know any game behind. Keep an eye on the um, back hall. If you see a robot coming up close, hold your breath with control. Okay. I don't know if I think from what that <laughs> that was there. It's in a series. I'm sorry. I wish I could like have this be like full screen or something. Oh wait. Wait, can I? Oh, yeah. Dead fish key. Far from me. Can I see my mouse, please? Selenon is a world leader in shipping and handling worldwide, with over 280 ships on our fleet. Here at Selenon, we believe in the power of collaboration, innovation, and efficient teamwork. We have over 80,000 hardware and crew members and shipping agents who will proudly welcome you to be a driving force in the logistics industry. So come join us at Celadon, empowering the economy. So, so we're okay. We're on a ship. Far from land. Okay. Ooh. All right, Malcolm. This week will be a bit different. Just get the ship running, and I'll run you down on the details. Um. Ooh. Wow. Anyways, we got some big news from Celadon themselves. Apparently, we have a special delivery this week. I know this month's been really tough for you, but this is pretty important. You remember those robots from that warehouse? Seems like some company has bought them and wants to take them to their facility. The problem is their facility is pretty far from here. Although this will definitely frighten you knowing all the stuff that has happened recently, we are taking huge safety measures with this. Um. First off, you'll be doing this by yourself. The crew members won't be in the ship during voyages, and you'll mostly be in charge of both steering and taking care of the ship. This is all just so we can minimize any danger that comes with delivery, as this is a pretty long journey. Since our regular routine has changed so much, I'll have to reread the instructions on how to handle the ship for you just in case, but I know you obviously know how to handle the ship. I mean, yeah, you are the captain, but I mean, I've been nominated by staff to do so. I so, don't know what I'm looking at. <laughs> what? In front of you lies the steering wheel. If you okay. hover over the left, middle, or right part of the wheel, You'll be able to move and turn the ship left and right. Try it out. Oh. Ooh. Great. Either you took ages or a few seconds to understand. By the way, this is you'll most likely cool. need a lot of obstacles in the way during your voyages. The weather there is hectic, so be sure you're careful driving around and don't end up smashing into icebergs or seagulls. There are a handful of other things in your cockpit. All the screens monitor to certain things. You have a motion detector that scans the whole ship for anything that moves. You have a monitor that keeps track of your distance, and a monitor that keeps track of your water pump and ship integrity. That's a lot of monitors. This ship is extremely old, by the way. It'll be decommissioned sometime soon, but it was really the only ship that was available. You'll most okay, likely experience good. the ship breaking apart from time to time, and stuff tends to malfunction a lot. That's... Uh, that's there concerning. There are ship horn that'll scare any intruders away if they're outside or if there's any incoming obstacles. You also have a water pump lever to your right. 
which refills your water level if it drains. It seems like the last crew forgot to refill it. Try to use the horn and also refill your water pump by pulling the lever. Okay, um... How do I use the horn? Oh. will roam this night. If you see him in the hallway, hold your breath from control if he gets too close. going all right okay this is pretty cool like they're very like I've like that Halfway there, so stay alive for a little bit longer. You knew this was here, and you didn't fucking tell me. Okay. I know something burst in here. So wait, I, I wait here. Why do 
you have to, like, the default of us. Okay. So this seems pretty interesting, like, I've played very few Roblox FNAF games, like, I've played that, like, I, I forget which one it was, it was, like, the one where you, there was, like, the different animatronics, you have to do a bunch of objectives and stuff. They like, got these different versions of Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, Foxy. You get, like, the Phaser Blast, I know... The first objective is already out pizza, collecting pizzas, and there's forgotten memories. Um, ship integrity. Why is the integrity going down? That's concerning. Wait, what happens if... Not really helping. Um. So when the integrity goes out, I have to fix it. Okay, good to know. First thing's never usually that bad, right? Oh, 
I just fix it. Okay. It's a lot more tense sometimes when you're in the one when you're the one in control of your progression. And it's not just your vibe. In order to get to where in order to proceed, you have to you have to do it. I don't know if that's a glitch, but the horn is not working. I hear birds. Repose. Come on. What just happened? Oh, okay, I thought the game crashed or something. <laughs> Alright, so now what? Okay. Oh, it's loading. Oh, yeah, there's my name. You can add me on here, I don't care. <laughs> Alright, don't expect me to play this. Lot, the crew's finishing like, their play shift. Roblox. And First voyage wasn't that awful, eh? Anyways, you'll now have to complete the ship safety checklist. Don't worry, it shouldn't be too hard. The checklist will include all of the tasks you need to complete before leaving. If you're confused as to what to do, the checklist includes a guide just in case. It gets pretty dark in there though, so make sure you aren't wandering in the dark all the time. See you tomorrow. Your shift is not over yet. Before you leave the ship, you must complete the ship safety checklist. All your tasks are listed in your checklist along with a guide, but be careful, monsters monster is lurking in the upper deck. If you hear breathing, hold your breath with shift. Don't turn on your flashlight or walk away until the breathing goes away. If you don't hear anything breathing, use control to use your flashlight. <laughs> Fix pipes, collect jerry cans, replace generator food, stable power. What was that? Okay. Oh, we have a map on here, thank god. Okay, so that's one. Okay. Replace generator fuse, so that's a fuse. Um, It'd be cool if we could pull the horn though. Wait a minute. Okay, I gotta try it. What the fuck is that?
Damn it, we should be able to pull that. Okay. How many is that? Three out of four. Okay. This call lift. Ah, oh, shit. Nope. it though oh my okay you died okay oh my god uh. <laughs> all right we're here back here um fix all the pipes okay Cat. Wait, there's something that way. Find one. Oh, what's this? Power box. <gasps> Was that okay? So we just need to replace generator fuse. Oh. What the hell was that thing? Looked like some freaking. I don't know. <laughs> Can't go that way. Wait, we're all the way back here, so then where's the generator? Ooh, the thing sounds loud. Okay, now what? Oh, generators are. The generators right here. <laughs> Bro. Okay. I stopped. It. Okay, now what? Okay. Voyage complete. How? Second voyage, okay. And, okay. Malcolm, but here is still one piece. So I don't take notice of what happened yesterday and decided to do some improvements on the ship. And they wanted me to tell you about it. 
Don't worry about the last ship. We're all still confused on how one of the robots are going to escape. We're forced to add a few extra security measures to the ship so it doesn't happen again. Anyways, we managed to install a shower handle at the back hall for the left door. If you go back and check the door, you'll see a yellow handle. We figured that if any of them escape their container again, you can use the handle to temporarily damage their surface. Okay. We don't really know if this will cause any permanent damage to the robots, which would keep me alive, a, uh, I don't care. Lawsuit. But it was the cheapest solution we could find. If any of them are outside the door, pull the handle and it'll release water. Which should hopefully stir them Be careful with how long you use the shower handle as it will increase the amount of water you have left. If that happens, you can refill your water with a lever in your cockpit to the right. Just keep track of your motion detector if any new ones happen to escape the ship. And you should be good. I'll let you know if we've done anything else to your ship. Good luck. Alright, one of them's coming. We can't get locked in our role over on the ship this way. Don't take different take a different path. He cannot He cannot be seen, but you'll hear him when he's outside. Use the motion detector to track his movement. You have been equipped with an emergency shower. Use it once you you know he's outside your door. Okay, he's gone.
Well, are you gonna do anything, or are we just gonna play a scare? Yeah. Are we gonna? Are you gonna do something, or are we just gonna do a scaring, a staring contest? There we go. Yeah, no one's here. Get the frick out of here. Water, so I should be more careful about it. Nobody oh, no, it's still going down. Okay, I thought that was something. Okay. Do I just have to... Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, so if no one... Okay, so I can just... Stop. So low, I wish it was a click. Click to move there. Okay, so as long as he's not moving, I can still be doing everything else. Oh my fucking god! I didn't see him move in the fucking. Oh, that's so. Marcus will enter. Bro, I didn't even see like see anything or hear anything. Like I didn't hear and hear him, and I didn't see anything on the thing other than the other dude. Is there a way I can like skip this like call part? Malcolm, Malcolm, glad to hear still in one piece. So I don't take notice of what happened yesterday. They sent the news of improvements on the ship, and they wanted me to tell you about it. Don't worry about the last ship. We're all still. Here. One of the robots already managed to escape. We're forced to add a few extra security measures to the ship so it doesn't happen again. Anyways, we managed to install a shower handle at the back hall for the left door. If you go back and check the door, you'll see a yellow handle. We figured that if any of them escape their container again, you can use the handle to temporarily damage their shoulders. We don't really know if this will cause any permanent damage to the robots, which would lead to a uh, lawsuit, but it was the cheapest solution we could find. I tried to. If any of them are outside the door, pull the handle and it will release water. Which should hopefully steer them off. Be careful with how long you use the shower handle as it will drain the amount of water you have left. If that happens, you can refill your water with a lever in your cockpit to the right. Okay. Just keep track of your motion detector if any new ones happen to escape the ship. And you should be good. I'll let you know if we've done anything else to your ship. Good luck. I tried playing this in like uh, on PlayStation 5, but it was just like this game cannot be played on place. Well, it says PlayStation 4, but basically this game can't be played in console, so it can only be played on PC and mobile.
just keep moving.
Hey guys, sorry for the silence that bit. Okay, sorry for the silence that bit. I was on the phone, my sister and my sister called me. And... What? Oh. Okay. And I figured out, okay, so I had to turn my headphones up in order to actually, in order to actually hear that thing that came in from the side. This do okay no. Wonder if it's a secret or something you have to figure out. Okay, no 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 no. hang of this like the gameplay loop and everything anything of this here no nope. oh found the fuse oh I went the wrong way No, you go away. Something tells me I should have put that in last. Look, well, didn't we just go around this whole place? There it is, okay. Okay, so I want to make sure that if I go into the game <laughs> first that I don't have to restart anything, please. But yeah, guys, that this is uh, Far From Land. I will be continuing it, and um, if you enjoyed, 
leave a like, comment, share, subscribe. I play Five Nights at Freddy's, Five Nights at Freddy's fan games. I'm not just Five Nights at Freddy's. I also do do. Uh, I know you. One of you guys are calling. Okay, so we can continue. We can continue. Can okay. Wait a minute. When I select forward, like when I select right, and this, you can hear, it's the, you can hear, not the boo, but if you listen, if these guys would shut up. That balloona, balloona, not the boo, boo, do you listen? If you hear it in the background, that's uh, okay. That's the sound from, uh, d that's the, uh, uh, sound from Dead Space. Uh, when you're navigating through, like, the inventory and the menus and everything. Well, guys, this is Far From Land. It is on Roblox, only available on mobile and PC. So yeah, I highly recommend checking this game out. This what the fuck is any of this shit down here? Um, but we will be continuing this. It's pretty good, very well made. And uh, yeah, anyways, guys, hopefully you all enjoyed. Um, okay. Uh. Why? <laughs> But yeah, guys, hopefully you all enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, don't forget to turn on notifications, join... As I say, I don't say that anymore. But don't forget to turn on notifications, join Discord and everything, all that in the description below. And... Well, yeah, besides FNAF and, fan, and FNAF fan games, I play horror games and indie games, so... Yeah, I will see you all in the next one. Peace.